Hi everybody, welcome back to Rolling Through Life. My name is Wanda. I have another haul for you. So I went to the other um, Dollar Tree on the other side of town. Um, what was I doing on that? I had to mail off some packages and I figured I'd just go ahead and go down there. So, um, yeah, um, our town really sucks. I mean, we didn't have none of the new products I've seen out. But that's okay, I got a few things that I needed. So the first thing I picked up was the White Rain um, shampoo and conditioner in Apple Blossom. This stuff, oh my gosh, oh, it smells so good. Um, so yeah, so I needed some shampoo, so I got that. I always wait till the last minute to get shampoo. I had like one or two um, washings left in my bottle, so I figured I better pick them up now. Um, you know, I went all winter wearing short socks because I never see the longer ones at Dollar Tree, but this time I did. So it has two pair for a dollar. So um, I know winter's almost over, but there are still going to be a few cold days, so. Went and got a couple pair of those. I have a bag down there. Um, I picked up 10 of these storage containers, or these, um, yeah, the totes. Um, they're 10 and a half by 10 and a half by 11. Um, they fit my shelves really well. Um, I like the ones at Home Depot better. These will do better for the pinch I'm in. What I want to do is all the um, yarn I have wound in um, cakes that every time I go looking for color, I'm knocking them over and stuff. So these are going to be great because I want to sort them out by color and then um, I'll be able to actually find what I'm looking for. So I got 10 of those, which these are the bigger sizes that um, Odd Lots is selling or these are the bigger sizes that um, Dollar Tree is selling now, so which is great. Um, I got two more of these two and a half gallon um, uh, storage bags. They're freezer bags with the um, the zipper on them, and there's five in here for a dollar, which is great. Um, I use these as project bags. You know, I was kind of weary of these when I first um, got them last week or so. Um, but they're actually, they hold up very well. So, I got two more boxes. That should do me, because I never have more than 20 projects going on at a time. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I got two more of those. Um, I got a couple things I didn't need, but I seen them and I wanted them. And I get the Peeps Bunnies. Um, there's eight in each one for a dollar. Get the pink and the yellow. I've had these in the house for two days. Still haven't opened them, which is a good thing. But, you know, Easter comes once a year. <laughs> and I don't buy the Peeps during Christmas or anything. So Easter is the only time I get them. And then I went and got some really nice cards. Um, I was surprised. I've never gotten cards um, at um, the Dollar Tree before. But this one says Shine On. Then we have, um, it says, Hey Friend, You've Got Style. I like that one. Um, this one says, friends and shoes have a lot in common. I thought that was gorgeous. Then this one, it says, the world is a little brighter today. And I actually picked up two of these. This one says, on your birthday. And 
change. This one says, today is the start of something good. I really like the gold foil on that. Or not gold foil, but it's like a really shiny red right there. So I, I like that. And then this one says, every day is a place we've never been before. Which is so true. Thought it was cute. And then, oh, I got another one of the today is the start of something good. Didn't realize I picked up two of those, but. And another of the dog. And then this one, I thought, uh, this one I really liked. This is happy birthday. It's got an old time bike on there. Thought it was really cute. So I think, yeah, that's all I got at Dollar Tree. Not a big haul, but you know, I got a few things I needed. And then I went over to Ollie's, which is a discount store, something like Big Lots. So I picked up a few things there. Um, I had to get another um, can opener. This one's $2.99. Um, I went to go use my can opener the other can opener the other day, and it was broke. It would not turn. So, and I'm telling you what, as a left-hander, I break a lot of can openers. Um, I guess if you turn them the wrong way, then you know they break easier. But it happens sometimes. So, and then I needed a set of um, sharpies. These were a dollar ninety-nine for four of them. Then I seen this. They had their DVDs half price. Now I'm old school. I like DVDs. I know half this stuff I could probably get downloaded. But I like the DVDs. But um, this is um, an HBO stand up comedy special Roseanne Barr, Blonde and Bitchin'. Um, so I got it for a dollar. It was marked at um, $1.99. I like Roseanne. I like her sense of humor. Then I uh, picked up a couple books. This one is called The Reason. Every moment contains sprinkled seeds of something greater. If you only take the time to look by William Searles. It's a novel and on the back it says, Welcome to Southeast Michigan and the small town of Carlson where faith, hope, and struggle are defined by the different faces of those who live there. Um, an addict that sits at a bar to forget, a mother whose five-year-old boy has leukemia, two doctors, an atheist haunted by his past, and a brilliant young oncologist that places all her hope in the power of modern medicine. A blind pastor whose son hasn't spoken a single word in 38 years, but the minister sees by faith. He knows there are answers and believes that Someone who cares is watching. Someone with a greater purpose. Yet there is something he doesn't know. That none of them know. In the midst of the ordinary and the devastating, there is a reason these lives will be changed forever. Lightning is about to strike. Um, that sounded really interesting to me. So, yeah, I picked that up. I want to get back into reading. I, I just haven't read in so long. Now, one of my favorite um, authors is Jerry B. Jenkins. He's one of the authors of um, Left Behind series. And he wrote this with James S. McDonald. It's called I Saw. And on the back it says, A young seminary professor, Augustine Knox, is drawn into a deadly race to save priceless parchments from antiquities, thieves, and discovers a 2,000 year old connection with another who faced death for the sake of tr the truth. I saw consist of two riveting adventures in one, transferring you, transporting you between the stories of Augustine Knotts and Saul of Tarsus. Filled with political intrigue, romance, and rich historical detail, I saw is a thrilling tale of loyal friendship tested by life or death quests set two millennia apart told by a master storyteller 
sounded really interesting. That was four ninety nine. And in the stores it went for twenty four ninety nine. I've been seeing this on Amazon a lot and I really wanted to get it. And when I seen it at Ollie's for five bucks, I had to pick it up. I had to. So yeah. I wanna try to read like thirty minutes a night before I take my medicine to go to sleep. And um because I just don't seem to find the time anymore. And I need to find the time to do that. That's what keeps your brain active. You, you know, keeps your words in your mind. So I really need to start um, reading again because I lose my thoughts very quickly these days. But besides that little tangent there. Um, yeah, that's what I got at Ollie's and Dollar Tree. Um, it was nice to get out. Um, I haven't been getting out that much in the past month. So to get out two days in a row was great. So that's all I have for you today. Um, I hope to have another video up for you tomorrow. So let's cross our fingers and hope that nothing goes wrong with the day and I can get that done. So I will see you guys later. To anyone who is new to the channel, welcome. Welcome to my crazy world. Um, I do a lot of different things on here. My life is crochet and uh, shopping, you know, so lots of things. So, um, yeah, welcome, and I hope you stick around for a while. And thank you for those that's been here for a while for coming back. Um, yeah. So I just want to thank you all, and uh, make sure you hit that like button, and um, subscribe if you're not subscribed and hit that notification bell and you'll be notified every time I upload a video. Leave a comment down below. Um, tell me what your favorite thing is that I hauled. I don't know. Or just say hi. I'll see y'all later. Bye.